Today we're going to be unboxing the one and only Ant Farm Revolution. This has a lot of hype behind it and it's a really popular item. So let's take a look inside, see what it has to offer. Hi, I'm Tyler. This is How to Ant Farm. Let's talk about ants. So let's get started. Okay, first things first. I'm noticing the actual ant farm itself. Let's cool. Spin it. And I don't think it, it's unscrewing. Yeah, it's not unscrewing, you just spin it. That's pretty neat. Next, you've got um, some instructions in a little baggie. Um, it tells you what to do inside of here. So then you have your starting rod, which is a lot longer than most of them. And Uncle Milton actually is nice enough to give you a free shipment of ants if you were to uh, order with them. So it's really important you hang on to this. So it's looking to me like there's nothing else inside the box for the ant farm revolution. So we have our ant farm revolution. This is a pretty cool product for a couple of reasons. The gel inside, much like the other gel colonies, actually will feed them, hydrate them, and it treats it as you know dirt. They can dig through it. Um, another neat feature about this one is you have the light, which we have not installed yet, but you have the light you can put in the middle. And then what's extra cool is it has this magnifier up here and the light will shine onto this It'll put the shadow of the ants through this, magnify it, and actually hit the roof or the wall or wherever you have it pointing. Um, it's really cool, especially for little kids. They love it. They love it, love it, love it. So this is our first time ever in How to Ant Farm that we're going to be using the Ant Farm Revolution. And it recommends, just like the Ant Universe, the blue gel, um, to dig four starting tunnels. And we preferred one on the long flat ant farms. However, we've never done this one before, so we're gonna to stick to the instructions and also for review purposes, it makes sense. So without further ado, I'm gonna dig the four starting tunnels. You're gonna take your starting rod, you're gonna place it, and you're gonna push down. The first thing I'm noticing is it's giving much easier than the other ones were. It's very soft. Um, I think it has partially to do with the fact that it is circular. Another thing we notice is that we do live in a desert and maybe the heat got to this product before we could properly install the um, starting holes. The entire uh, and gel is actually moving. I'm not sure if that's what it's supposed to do, but we will see how this product works when we get the ants. So what I've noticed about this is it's looking like it's going to be a great product. The gel was much softer this time around. I don't know if that was because of the heat, because we do live in a desert. Um, at the same time, um, it's looking like it's going to be pretty great and I can't wait to get some ants inside of this. So we will check back with you in a little bit once we get some ants in here and we'll do a follow-up video.